Hi you two, this is part two of conditional only method, y'all. <laughs> a lot of people ask me questions. I've been out of town, y'all. I just got back in. So I wanted to answer a few questions. Um okay, one question was it can you use I me mean, leave in? Can you leave leave in, in your hair? Yes, leave in is meant to be left in your hair. So leave in is not gonna um um clog your pores not gonna leave a fungus or anything so yeah i could you could use leave-in all day long almost if you're allergic to it then you know discontinue but if you're not you can leave leave-in in your hair so okay um conditional only method um a lot of people i knew it was gonna be controversial i try to be respectful for the girls are doing it it's fine it's fine if y'all having great results i was just talking about our family we're not trying it um and conditional only means conditional only not conditioner and alls and conditioner and i use this to help the conditional only method no if you say i'm using doing a conditional only method that's what it means conditional only not to help it's like a bad relationship you're just trying to make it work and work and work and it's not working for you okay discontinue it's just simple it's not it's not that serious um also um what i was telling you about the fungus your scalp have to breed every them that everything have to breathe y'all if you was to take wet clothes and take wet clothes and just keep it wet in a uh, place and it's not breathing okay guess what it develops a fungus just like your scalp your scalp needs to breathe they have a um a commercial um also about um strength in your hair you want your hair to be strong at the strongest point yeah um you don't want your hair weak at all. So conditioner, the longer you keep conditioner in your hair, the softer your hair get. Okay? So anything that's get real, real soft and brittle, guess what it does? It breaks all day long. Common sense. If you leave something that will break your hair down where it's soft, then when you go to comb it, it's going to break off. But guess what? You did that. You left this in. The longer you left it in, the softer your hair got, your hair broke off. It's not worth it. It's really not. I don't do anything that I have to be like, like I said, a hundred times. Oh, Lord, I hope it worked. I don't do that. I don't take the chance. I know dyes can damage my hair. I do not put it in my hair. I know that heat can damage my hair. I don't put it in my hair. Look, it's not that serious, y'all. If you have to be hoping and praying something work, don't do it. It's don't do it. If you leave conditioner in your hair, conditioner is sticky all day long. It's sticky. If it dries, it's gonna dry up sticky. So guess what happens when stuff gets sticky? It um grabs lint, it grabs dirt. That's what happens to stuff that's sticky. Okay, so. Conditioner dries up sticky. It dries up a film. If you like that look, that's fine. You go out and look like that. That's cool. I'm just saying for our family, that's not a good look for us. Now, you can tell somebody to grab a conditioner and they have all these ingredients that cannot pronounce and they put this on their scalp anyway. Okay, you want to go natural. You get these conditioners that you cannot pronounce. And you want to leave this stuff in your hair. And you want to say, it's fine. But you don't even know the name of this stuff you're leaving in your hair. And it wasn't meant to be left in your hair. So, I'm just saying, just use common sense. Just use, it's just, it's not that serious. Just use common sense on what you put in your hair. I use a lot of stuff that I can't pronounce, but it was meant to be left in my hair. If it doesn't work, I take it out. Okay? So, what else are people was asking me about the conditioner on it? Um, I'm trying to remember the stuff, but a, a lot of questions was asked about the conditioner on it. If you want to try it, try it. That's your hair. Whatever you want to put in your hair. Put it in. You don't need to, need to take my advice. Just put it in. Just do it. And see how you like it. See if you like 
sticky, filmy, um, defined curls in your hair. And if you need to put a, a extra stuff, do it. That's your hair. But we're not doing it at home with hair. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. Not to offend no one. Not to be disrespectful to no one's feelings. This is something that's best for us. So whatever... I'm sorry, y'all. I, I really, I really want to be so respectful in this video. I do. I really, I really don't want to hurt no one's feelings. This video is not to hurt no one's feelings. Um, if it works for you, if it honestly works for you, then continue on doing. You don't need me to put an amen to it. Just do it. And continue on doing it. And that's you. Okay. So, I still love y'all. <laughs> I'm telling you, I still love y'all. And everybody that's doing it. I'm still going to continue looking at y'all video. I'm y'all biggest fan. I'm telling you, I'm y'all biggest fan. And um, it's just some things that I don't agree with. I just don't agree with. And I'm not going to sugar sugarcoat it. I'm not going to... Um, I hate BS, so I'm not going to BS you either. If it doesn't look right to me and it don't sound right, I'm going to tell you my honest opinion. And that's my honest opinion. So, I am so sorry about this video. Sure is. But, I'm still going to continue watching y'all. Bye, YouTube. This family God natural. Started off on conditional only method two. Second video, y'all. I'm the same video. Anyway, bye, YouTube.